So I'm back again. So I'll be sharing uh, my experience of React JS and Jenkins. So let's start. So these are the three projects, main projects that um, have React JS technology used in it. So in the first, next upcoming slides, I'll be going through each project and telling you all about uh, in brief about what the projects are and uh, how you can help us. Right. So, so this is the first project. It's called Custom Distribution Service. So this project was started last year and it, as a GSOC project only. And uh, I contributed this year uh, in the React JS uh, field, and I request which all of them got merged. So I had zero knowledge about React JS before uh, before contributing. I really had zero knowledge, and uh, when I got to learn about this project, I was interested to you know start my open source journey. And this was the project with how I started with Jenkins. So. With the help of my contribution, I was able to learn about uh, concepts like component states, React hooks, also SAS and uh, UI designing as well. And there were so many other things as well, like soft skills, like how to talk to uh, people and so many things. And after that, one more thing that I really loved was that I got opportunity to get my code reviewed by someone who's really experienced. So to be precise, Gavin Morgan was one of them who um, go, went through my code and told me that what are the, you know, the best uh, practices when you're writing react js code so that was something i really loved as well and uh, coming to the areas where we need your help and you can help us are these are the issues that uh, you can help us with and these are just one of some of the issues that we uh, placed on the slide and you can go to the issues uh, link and you'll be able to find all the list and this is the second project which is called pipeline graph view plugin so it is a project which is now current it just recently started and uh, just I, I want to st stress this uh, more that this project is uh, going to be really really uh, popular because it works on some uh, as an alternative for blue ocean plugin so any contribution you on this plugin it will be really hard, right so uh, and there's going to be a demo session on this pipeline a plugin that that will help you all to know about what this actually is and uh, yes how this plugin works and what are the requirements of this so you'll be able to learn more about it on the demo sec uh, session as well now this is the last project that i want to share with you so it's called plugin site and uh, i'm sure uh, people who learn uh, know about jenkins and have been using it definitely know about the site because it's very famous and people refer uh, go through this site in order to learn search about uh, plugins and try to understand which are the new plugins and recently updated and trending ones and everything. So these are the issues that we have and you can solve uh, and help us with. And there are more issues if you click on this link and you'll be directed to the page where you can help us. So, Diraj, Diraj, sorry, I need to pause for just a minute. Oh no, Jyoti's in, okay, sorry. I, we we had a an issue that a participant needed to be brought in. Yes, I admitted. So got her. Thank. You. Okay, awesome. So yes, and uh, huh, yes, the, I was uh, going to share one thing that is this uh, website plugin site is made by Gavin Morgan as well. So he's the same person who helped me during my code reviews. So my point here is that you, when you're contributing to Jenkins, you get to. Uh, interact and know and being mentored by someone who are working on some of the most popular projects in Jenkins. So it's, I, I feel it's a privilege to be uh, at such an environment. So that's my take. And I would really encourage every one of you to, you know, test out your knowledge. If you're interested in ReactJS, then you can uh, start with any of these projects and You'll be creating a lot of impact, I'm sure. You can definitely reach out to the data channels and reach and personally message as well if you like. So, yes. Back to you, Mark. Thank you. And would you be willing to grant me hosting again so that so that I could do you know how to do that? So participants um, on Mark Wait, do a more and then it will make host. Make host, yes. Uh, done. Oh, good. Thank you. Thanks very much. All right, I have the controls back. Thank you. And I may have to give you 
give you control again later, but let me share my screen and let's look a little bit further then. So how about a pause here to check, actually before I share, let's pause to check to see, are we meeting your needs? Are there things that you would like to discuss further? Do you want me to go back to the, to the adopt a plugin? Are there specific questions you'd like to address?